Do you see that woman there? Yes. She's from a good family. She was soon married and quickly gave birth to a boy. And a year later, a girl. If the purpose of this story is to annoy me, then you've succeeded. The purpose is to make the point she's quite similar to you. With the not-so-subtle distinction being that she's married and has children. She had children. It was six months after the birth of her daughter, a seemingly inexplicable act, that the young woman saw fit to submerge both her children in a bathtub until they were drowned. Owing to the wealth and influence of her family, she was spared from being sent to prison or an institution. However, instead of proper treatment, she now walks the park daily, pushing an empty perambulator. But I can find no empathy for a mother who would take the life of her own children. But you understand the expectations that our society bestows on women. To marry, to have children, to smile when you feel incapable of smiling. If you can empathize with that, you know better than most that that poor young woman with an empty baby carriage did not form herself. Rather, society formed her. You say you cannot see the world from the perspective of a child killer because you could never kill a child. I believe we all possess the raw material required to commit horrible acts. You just need the right or wrong combination of events to make the raw material combustible. I'm afraid I must be on my way. Good day. Alienist, on you Mondays at 9 on TNT, and watch anytime on demand and on the TNT app.